Hey y'all, welcome to Flame Tarot. I'm here to give y'all some messages. Uh, all right, let's see. Let's see what comes out. Right, give me some messages. All right, so we got the moon in reverse. Starting off with damn illusions. Somebody's trying to hide something. Wow, and judgment is there. Damn. This is crazy. So something is definitely over that somebody was trying to hide. I, I see the two of swords there. Uh, the nine of wands. Let me let me just keep going. Let's, let's just keep going. Uh, King of swords. Let me let me put those back in there. They just kind of fell out. Wow. So I feel like somebody is hiding something or somebody. Uh, wow. Look at that. The sun card. Whatever they hiding is 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 getting exposed here, and everybody's gonna see it or light is going to be shed on it or something like that. Uh, the Six of Pentacles. Wow. Let's see. Eight of Cups. Yes. The light is being something, is being shed on something that was hidden here. And somebody's going to have to walk away or somebody's walking away because of it. Look at that. The King of Swords. It's giving me some sort of truth came out. Or somebody knows some information about what's going on or... Also, we have Cancer, Pisces energy, and then we have um, Leo energy here. Let's see. Got the Three of Wands is here. Yeah, this gives me like some sort of, following up right underneath the Moon card, this gives me like some sort of um, foresight into what's been hidden here as well. Or, or somebody could be waiting on something to come out as well, too. Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like somebody's waiting on something to come out, possibly. Or somebody could have insight into the future to the uh, and, and to the present, because the sun is the present. Uh, let's see. The Knight of Pentacles. Something that somebody could have been possibly working on for a long time is coming to light here. Two of Wands possibly about where people are traveling to or uh, look at this the knight of cups something about an offer someone is walking away from possibly or it's been it's taken a long time for someone to come and make an offer or work hard on something But I see someone possibly getting an offer here, maybe. Look at that, the Queen of Pentacles. We could be talking about an Earth sign here. Five, five of Wands is on top of the deck. And the Queen of Swords, wow. And then the King of Wands. Mm, I don't know, so, something about a fight possibly, or Something could be hidden here, or something could be coming out that somebody's walking away from. It's like they got enough information or something like that. Uh, but also, also, I'm I'm feeling like after walking away from something and looking more into something or something like that, or having some sort of foresight is here into what's going on in the situation. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Let's clarify uh, this moon in reverse. Let's see. Let's get one for this moon in reverse. Let me get one for the moon in reverse. Wow, the knight of, knight of wands in reverse. Yeah, somebody knows uh, some information about someone possibly. Now, the knight of wands in reverse is like a, a sexual person possibly or like somebody that's uh, that gets around possibly, or just is just there for a good time. But this is also someone that has bad intentions as well too. It's in reverse. Look at that, the Knight of Pentacles. Why wow, is a whole lot of knights out here? So it's a whole lot of traveling, possibly a whole lot of people in cars or something like that, or uh, something like that. Shit, I don't know. Let's get one more. It fell on the floor. The Six of Cups. Yeah, something about the past is here. Uh, Let's, let me get let me get one for the, the that's the ten of pentacles wanting to come out, flip over. This is it's a lot of people here possibly. Let me get one more for the moon reverse. Wow, look at this another knight, the knight of swords. 
yes, a lot of information coming out. The truth is coming out about something here, about what somebody's been doing behind the scenes or something like that, or what somebody's been working on, possibly. Let's get one for the sun card. The Ace of Swords, man, the truth. <laughs> So the truth is out here. Somebody knows the truth. Something is getting exposed for sure. Four of Swords. Somebody could could be getting could be resting now, or just I don't know if they're getting laid to rest. Uh, the Queen of Pentacles again. Something about Earth Earth energy is here, or somebody um, somebody could also be at peace or something like that as well. The Temperance card. Look at that. I'm just talking about peace. Somebody's somebody is definitely at peace here. This is also divine timing playing out. Uh, all right, let's do the court cards next. Let's see. Look at that. The Ten of Cups. Something about somebody's happiness, happiness is here. This is the second ten that then came out. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Something about somebody's happiness is here. Maybe somebody's been trying to affect someone's happiness or something like that. Uh, I don't know where to put this one at. Let, let me just put it back in the in the deck. Let's get one for the uh, Knight of Pentacles. What about the Knight of Pentacles here? Wow, the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like somebody's holding on or holding back or uh, holding on to something or, or being selfish as well, too, or taking their time doing something, it seems like. Look at that, the World card. Something could be over. Oh, I didn't mean to show that card. <laughs> something could be over here for sure. Let me get one for the Knight of Cups. What's this Knight of Cups about? Wow, two cards, the Five of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. Wow, it looks like somebody's leaving the situation. I'm not sure, but this is also fate. Something is fated to happen this way as well. The Wheel of Fortune, Sagittarius energy. And then we've got the Chariot. Look at that, <laughs> Cancer energy. Something about someone moving or somebody just leaving a situation behind that's not going anywhere, possibly. Uh, let's get one for this. Let's, let's get one for the Queen of Pentacles. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? The Eight of Cups. Damn. So this Queen of Pentacles could be leaving a situation. It's the Eight of Cups twice. The King of Cups is there. So someone could be walking away from a water sign, or a water sign could be walking away from a, a King of, Queen of Pentacles or something like that. Let's get one for this Eight of Cups. Uh, well, we got two of them. We got the Queen of Wands and we got the Hermit card. Yeah, this is like someone walking away from investigating some, something. Or this could be also someone leaving because... I'm, I'm reading this a couple of ways. Somebody could be leaving because uh, they know they're worth it or they, they know that, that they deserve something better or something like that. Now, this, this que the Queen of Wands and the Hermit, that's like an old couple. So somebody could be like bored here. Uh, or this is like an older person and then, and then like a mid a middle aged person or something about someone doing some soul searching as well too or um, I, I'm, I'm picking up vanity but I'm also picking up uh, some sort of magic as well too the queen of wands and then the hermit this gives me like somebody's doing something to for someone to leave possibly the star card And then the six of wands is on top of the deck. Let's see. Let's let's get one for this uh, uh, three of wands here. I was thinking about something. <laughs> uh, the eight of pentacles, but it, it, it fell on the floor. So let me put it back. So something about someone's work. Somebody could be trying to affect someone's work as well, too. Or somebody, uh, it's a lot of moving parts here. Let's see. The knight of pentacles. Wow. Yeah, something about, I don't know, this two Knights of Pentacles and two Eight of Cups here. Uh, then you got the moon and the sun. So this talks about, maybe this is talking about a phase that someone is going through. Or somebody could be um, leaving a phase or of their life or something like that. Or wanting more or looking for more or expecting more or something like that. Uh, or also they could be working on something. Also, I see something about Puerto Rico is here, or Venezuela. I don't know if this is their... Whose flag is that? That gives me Puerto Rico or Venezuela or something like that is here. Uh, 
Huh. We got the three of wands again. Damn, look, I'm telling you. Three of wands twice. Nine of pentacles twice. Eight of cups twice. And then all these knights out here. Maybe it's a lot of suitors here. Maybe uh, the sun. <laughs> I'm not making this shit up. And then the strength card. I don't know. I feel like somebody is has a lot of strength right now. Or somebody has, maybe they've, they've gained the strength to leave or gained some sort of insight about something and they just ready to leave a situation or uh, possibly, okay, also this three of wands on top of this nine of pentacles, is this could be talking about something that somebody's been working on for a while. Uh, or thinking about for a while. Something like that is here. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, what other deck I'm going to get out of here? You know what? Let's let's get this uh, archetype. Archetype deck. And let's see what kind of person this is. Because uh, I'm curious. I don't know. Now, I stopped asking about... Well, I'm not necessarily just stop asking about zodiac signs, but... I just be trying to see what's out there, what's just gonna come out, you know? I like a little randomness. Let's see. A vampire. It says, make sure you're aware that something or someone is draining your life force. Depleting uh, others, well, the shadow attributes are depleting others for your psychic survival, chronic complaining, and codependency. Maybe this is what somebody is walking away from. Someone that sucks the life out of them or scribe. It says per, uh, light attribute, preserving knowledge and information. The shadow attribute is altering facts or plagiarizing others work. Also, somebody could be plagiarizing your work or just um, uh, telling people what you tell them. I don't know. This is this gives me like somebody asking you some questions about some random shit and you tell them and then they just, you know, they be like, oh, OK, cool. And they really going to tell somebody else that shit. That's what it is. Uh, something like that is here. Let me see. So I feel like whoever this is that's walking away has a lot of knowledge, possibly. This says Don Juan. It says the light attributes. Spotlights your positive, seductive qualities. And shadow attribute. Using the power of romantic attraction for private agendas. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody is just uh, a user here. They just want to have sex or something. Or... Uh, Child and Eternal is here. Let me see. Let me get one more. Let's just get one more. Let me see. Prince. <laughs> romantic, romantic charm and potential for power. Shadow attribute. Using power for self uh, aggrandizement. I don't know. Hermit. <laughs> Look, I'm not making this shit up. So look, the hermit, this gives me like reoccurring events. This is maybe this is what this is talking about. Reoccurring events or reoccurring past traumas that you've already been through. So it's just like they're coming back around. You know, history repeats itself. So I feel like shit is coming back around and you're noticing the patterns in people possibly that you're dating or uh, talking to. And they had the same patterns as other people. Uh, in your past or something like that. Uh, this is what this is kind of giving me because all these cards are reoccurring here. You got Hermit. It says, seek solitude to, f to focus intently on inner life, serves personal creativity, shadow attributes, withdraws from society out of fear or negative judgments from of others, refusing to help those in need. Look, you got the Hermit here twice. I'm going to just pull them out. Then you got the uh, Eight of Cups twice. So it's a lot of detachment is here. It's, I, that's what I'm kind of feeling like. It's a lot of detaching energies here uh, or a lot of people taking their time doing something um, where is that uh, what is the five of pentacles maybe we got the knight of cups let's see I'm gonna just put all these together this is the knight look at all these knights the knight of swords the knight of wands uh, the knight of pentacles twice we got the moon card. We got the sun card basically twice, right? Because uh, we we are it already came out. So the sun card twice. 
All right, we got the Hermit twice. Uh, where is it? Uh, the Three of Wands twice. So how many double cards do we have? We got one, two, three, four, five. Uh, five double cards, basically. Yeah, so number five is conflict. So somebody could be trying to keep you in some sort of... Uh, uh, conflict or loop or something like that or cycle or some something. I don't know. Then we got the, the King of Cups underneath the deck, remember? And then we have the Knight of Cups. This is almost the same like energy. Uh, so it's a lot of people. I don't know. This is a lot of people possibly coming towards someone. I don't know why teacher is here. I, don't, I didn't even see that. It says ability to communicate knowledge experience skill or wisdom shadow attributes manipulating or abusing students teaching negative traits and destructive skills yeah i don't know something something like that along those lines are here shit i don't know uh, <laughs> let me see let's uh i think i should just end that shit right there maybe Let me see. This is called a uh, broken mirror. I just I ain't never used this deck. Let's just let's see. Let's see what comes out. Shit, let's see what, what else comes out. Damn. Deuces. Fed up cutting ties. <laughs> Walking away. <laughs> this is what this is. I'm telling you, this is deuces. Unfinished business, proposal, forgiveness, and reconciliation. I don't know. You might be telling people, I, you know, it's it's all good. You know, I, I forgive you. Let's uh, agree to disagree and deuces. Shit, I don't know. That's what it sounds like to me. But thank you for tuning in, and I'll see y'all next time.